Hello everyone, happy to see you here and welcome back to my channel Brain Logic. In this video I can solve this really interesting and in the same way this is like a relaxing quick question. 70 plus 100 divided by 2. On the first side this is like a very simple question, right here we have addition, we have division, so everyone learns this stuff in the third grade or fourth grade, everyone know about this operation, everyone know about these numbers, we don't have like a huge values, we don't have any thousands, we don't have parentheses, exponents right here, so what is the correct answer? What do you think? Right here we have three options. We have option A, option B, option C, so three options. And right now I suggest you to pause the video and try to solve it by yourself. And of course we will check our answers here in just one minute. It will be really interesting, just trust me. This is a very tricky test and I hope you, you solve it correctly. Yeah, But we can easily check our answers in the, the comment section. It will be really interesting. So first of all I want to rewrite this question and I want to start with this solution. So 70 plus 100 divided by 2. So one part of students saw it like that and right now I do want to tell that this is correct or incorrect. I feel a percentage, some percentage sold it like that. So we have 70 plus 100, we go from left to right, so we have like 170 divided by 2 right here in the end, so divided by 2 equal to 85. Yeah, we have this option, this is like option A is a correct answer. So as you can see one part of students saw it like that and right now I do not tell that this is correct or incorrect, but a lot of students saw it like that they say, okay, let's solve this problem as I type it in from left to right, addition, then division. And right now I don't want to tell that this is correct or incorrect. I need, you need to understand what is the correct order to do this problem. Because obviously whatever order of operation we select is going to create a different answer, right? So we need to understand what is the correct order to do this problem. Addition then division or division then addition. Only two cases. Right here we, we check this first case with the first addition sign. But right now let's try to look at this in another perspective. We need to know what is the correct order to do this problem. But uh, the better way for us is to look at this correct order of operation. Yeah, let's look at this. This is a correct order of operation. Let's solve this according to, for example, PMDMC. I respect every order of operation. I respect board mass. I respect uh, another order of operation. But let's look at this question in perspective of PMDMC. This is the, our order of operation and let's solve this according to PMDMC. So we have 70 plus 100 divided by divided by 2. So this PMDMC works from the top to the bottom and we can easily go through the steps real quick. So the first step, parentheses. Are there any parentheses right here? No, I don't see any of those. We don't have any parentheses. As I told before, we just skip this part. The next step, exponents. So are there any exponents right here? No, I don't see any squares, cubes. As I told before, I don't see this. So we just skip this part. The next step, multiplication and division part, because this is one common group in, in PMDMC, this is one common group. Multiplication and division signs, let's look at it. I don't see any multiplication signs, so we just skip this part. But I see division sign. Right here we have this division sign. So we have these steps. So finally, after these three steps, if we, if we don't have this, we don't have parentheses, exponent, multiplication, we need to calculate our first step, our division, division part. So we have 70 plus 100 divided by 2 equal to equal to 50. Yeah, 70 plus 50. And as our last step right here we have addition, so we need this step and we don't have subtraction. Yeah, 70 plus 50 equal to 120. So saying in simply word, in conclusion, you need to do division and then you can easily add these numbers, these values. So division is before addition. And this is a correct uh, solution because this solution is according to PMDMC, which is absolutely correct correct answer. But one really important moment, if you look to this test, we don't have this option 120. Yeah, we don't have this option, so a lot of students, this is very bad because they go back to this like obvious solution. Because uh, just trust me, this is obvious solution, because uh, add, then divide, this is, looks like f first addition, then division, this looks like obvious solution, and one part of students saw it like that, this is absolutely wrong solution. As I told before, according to PMDMC or board mass or wherever you want order of operation, division all the time is before addition. So whatever you have, like doesn't matter what you have, numbers right here, you need to divide it first, then you need to add, or you need to divide, then you need to subtract. Yes, as you can see, multiplication group and division group, this is before addition and subtraction group. So all the time you need to divide, then you can easily add it. 
So correct answer is 120. This is not 85, this is not 50, but really important moment, we don't have this option right here. So this is like very tricky question for us because we don't have this option 120. Let's try to find it. Right here we have 5 factorial. Let's look at it. 5 factorial. This is a product from 1 times 2 times 3 times 4 times 5. Yeah, we have 1 times 2, 2, we have 6, we have 24, we have 120. So 5 factorial, this is the same as 120. So we can easily say that our answer is it's the same as 5 factorial, but in our case, our answer is 120. So this is like very tricky moment. So this option B, 120. This is a correct answer to our question. So we hope you understand this explanation all the time. Division is before addition. And uh, according to test, correct answer is 5 factorial. But according to PMDMC, correct answer is 100 and, uh, 120. Just learn and don't forget it. This is like a really great rule in your life or wherever you wherever you are. You need to know about it. But Because doesn't matter what order of operation, PMDMC, board mass, doesn't matter all over the world. The first is division, then addition. So this is my conclusion to this question. I hope you understand this explanation and I hope your answer is the same as mine. See you in the next videos and have a great day.